A storm in 1887 caused a ship to sink here off the coast of South Haven. 134 years later, Mother Nature has interfered again, allowing this same ship to enjoy another voyage. Every few years we see erosion. As the shoreline goes away, we see a big storm. It's causing the past. Now it won't be so easy to see. To come out and play. It was right there in the surf. A South Haven homeowner. She said she lived in the property for 40 years and they hadn't seen anything. Stopped by the Maritime Museum. We have people come in that report uh, potential shipwrecks that they have, may have found or rediscovered. From her bluff overlooking Lake Michigan. In this particular instance, it was in an area that we didn't know about. It can be seen when it's calm. Well, of course, we wanted to take a look at this. Valerie Van Heest of the Michigan Shipwreck Research Association was contacted. That homeowner was very aware, as everyone in the South Haven area is, that the city of Green Bay shipwreck was off Deer Lick Creek Beach. This wreck was about a half a mile south of that. Could this? If it was newly uncovered, we wanted to see what remained. Be that? As soon as I got to the property, looked down over the bluff, I saw the city of Green Bay. The battered. I recognized it was the same one. Broken bones of a schooner. It's about 80 feet long. It's about 25 feet wide. Decided to rise. Something catastrophic happened. More than 130 years after her demise. Erosion combined with maybe a big storm lifted the ship from where it was embedded for over 100 years and moved it south. This once public curiosity. Many people flocked to that beach um, because it was so easy to see the wreck in about five feet of water. Has upgraded. This is not a small piece of, of driftwood. Uh, this is a pretty substantial uh, section of uh, shipwreck. To a private beach. This is not nearly as accessible. Certainly kayakers and canoers can get there when the water is calm. The new resting place is likely temporary. The remains now don't seem so embedded in the bottom. The city of Green Bay. We'll keep an eye on this. May set sail again. I would not be surprised to hear that after another storm, it's no longer there. Brent Ashcroft, 13 on your side.